Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Uh, today I wanted to talk about and give my opinion about the uh, recent news of the Bengals firing defensive coordinator Terrell Austin. Uh, this was something that myself and a lot of other fans are calling for after uh, yesterday's debacle against the Saints, uh, the 51-14 uh, loss. And if you look back at the uh, previous four games, I believe what I saw uh, was that the Bengals set a record for most yardage given up over a four game span so it wasn't working and I'm glad to see them make the change so hopefully they can improve from here going forward because I honestly don't think it, it can get any worse now I just refuse to believe that this defense is this bad and the reason I say that is because you still have guys on the defensive line like Geno Atkins and Carlos Dunlap uh, you still have some version of Vontez Perfect whenever he actually plays. You have Preston Brown, Nick Vigil. Uh, in the defensive backfield, you have William, guys like William Jackson. Um, Jesse Bates has played well. Darquez Denard and Drake Kirkpatrick, who's much maligned, but he's serviceable at least. So with those names, I just have a hard time believing the defense is this bad. So uh, something wasn't working. Uh, and to me, it was the schemes. Uh, they were not rushing the passer at all. Uh, they offered no resistance. The tackling was poor, and teams were just doing whatever they wanted. Um, I've never seen anything like it. Uh, they might have hit Drew Brees one or two times yesterday. There was a play in the first quarter. I mean, other than that, like pretty much most of the season, uh, opposing quarterbacks have all day to sit back there. So it was a much needed change. Uh, I'm, I'm glad there was some accountability shown. Uh, of course, people are going to say, well, Marvin was the guy that needed to be fired. Well, I mean, yeah, but that was going to happen, so that's not really a conversation worth having at this time. And speaking of Marvin, he's going to take, take over defensive play calling duties, so uh, I'll be interested, interested to see how that goes given this defensive background. So uh, in conclusion, glad they make, made the change. Uh, they have a lot of work to do. I'm interested to see what, if anything, changes uh, schematically and in terms of technique uh, defensively because the prior stuff wasn't working. So anyway, thank you guys for watching, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.